Hi, this is the first in a series of videos I'm calling Sanctuary Systems. This is primarily a training and learning tool for the amazing folks who help run things at our church. But I'm making the video public because there may be some aspects of our systems, um, some gear we use or some weird hacks that might be useful to other churches out there. My goal is that by the end of this series of videos, you'll have a clearer understanding of how our systems work, how they work together, and why we've set them up this way. There will be some information that's very specific to our church setup right now, but also some general concepts. And even though I'm sure we will make incremental changes and improvements over time, my hope is that a greater understanding of the base systems will make it easier to pick up on the changes as they come. Okay, so in this video, we're just going to take the 30,000 foot view, the big picture, the broad strokes, and the broadest stroke of all is this. What are all the audio video systems for? What is the purpose? Focusing hearts on the greatness of God. That is the foundational goal that all of the systems are designed for. Do they accomplish that goal perfectly? Absolutely. No, no, of course not. But we're doing the best we can, and we're always trying to improve. So there are four main systems, sound, presentation, streaming, and lighting. At the center of the sound system, we have our mixer, the Soundcraft UI 24R. We have a few videos on how that is set up, how to run it, um, some troubleshooting tips, etc. Our presentation system has ProPresenter at its heart. That runs the projection for lyrics, scripture, um, announcements. There'll be a few videos on not just running ProPresenter, but uh, how to build a playlist for a Sunday morning, and how to control some of the less obvious features of the software, and how it connects with our streaming system. For people who can't be at church in person, we have a simple streaming system that allows them to still participate to some extent. Now, notice how sound, presentation, and streaming overlap. Lighting is kind of separate, uh, but the other three really interconnect. So even if you're only wanting to learn just one system, I think it's helpful to have this big picture understanding first. While we're still in overview mode, let me also point out that there is a handy black folder back on the tech table filled with simplified guides to most of the sanctuary systems. The guides are not as detailed as these videos, but it's a good place to look for instructions and answers. Also, those guides are easier to keep up to date than these videos, so they will also probably have the most current information. That's it for this video. Next up, a very practical video about how to turn stuff on. It is as boring as you expect, but spoiler, it's not as easy as you might think.